Thank you. Uh, just two very quick questions, um, maybe a, a third. I appreciate Member Buchanan's uh, connection here with respect to what was uh, pledged with respect to the uh, what the voters uh, voted on and what is actually being unfolded in, in the plan. Um, it, it, the voters in my district uh, in Fresno County voted to support this by about 55 to 45. In Tulare County, they, they opposed it about 55 to 45. There is a recurring undercurrent in our neck of the woods about the distrust of what was promised versus what is being performed. With a $10 billion price tag now being $100 billion or so, routes dramatically changed and the whole question of this interconnectivity braiding effort uh, that I think was some questions raised here. Why in the interest of clarity, transparency, information, why are we not giving the voters an opportunity to review this again? It has changed so dramatically that I think we owe the voters an opportunity to look at what is being proposed now. Um, Mr. You Patterson, if, if I could just respond to that. Um, you know, last year we had so many debates. We had it here in this committee a number of times. And the legislature did take a stand. So in my mind, it's kind of unfair to uh, put that to the CEO because this is a session that's sure, really noted. meant to move forward and not to rehash. Understood. All of those questions from last year. Understood. The specific reference to the uh, property being taken and